Uh, okay. Are we playing? We got music going? Yeah. So, it's me and Fred. Fred waves. Oh, no, no. he doesn't. He... Pause up. Okay. Uh. Pause up. Pause up. Pause up, people. So, like, I guess Darius requested that I do another video. Because I guess it's been a while. So, Hello, my new go. B T V D friend. I'm fucked, so my words are fucking up, so, but, mm -hmm. hello. Mm -hmm. Uh, for a tie. And, 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 and shit, fuck you. Uh, first, I would just like to state that it was awesome to see a Patrick, because it was getting to the point where they would only show him, like, once every two weeks, and that was not sitting right with me at all. It's like with Robin gone they don't know what to do with him or something like I don't I don't appreciate that um where it says right on here um I really enjoyed the scene with him and Emma it was only two minutes and that I did not appreciate sad that she think Eliza Hor is gonna be her new mommy <laughs> poor girl <laughs> um uh she okay uh let me crack my joke real quick okay y'all so y'all know maxi had that black eye and the reason why she got that black eye was because she went in there and was trying to tell the girls on how to look or whatever right so in my head y'all i'm like this feel me on this y'all girl you you gotta put in the work if you want to keep your man hair did nails there are oh, you fancy huh are oh, you fancy huh <laughs> <coughs> this is why I can't fuck with Fred. <coughs> Little Fred, shit Fred like that. Fred bitch. Get, get it right. <laughs> Fred so, Word. AKA Serrani. Tiara. I see Tiara. Tiara. My bad. I, did, I, I didn't know how to pronounce it. Okay. <coughs> um. What they doing to Johnny is just totally wrong. Like. They got him. What they got him doing? Okay, <laughs> sorry. No, seriously. Like, uh, I know, I know how he feeling. I know he is like hurting. Yeah, hurting. Fred said, and I know it's eat that hip that he caused that accident to kill those people. Okay. But uh. For him to like seriously have a, a mentally ill chick take the fall for it, that's that's kind of fucked up, and that's not the Johnny Zakara I fell in love with in 2006, and I don't appreciate it at all. Um, and this is just my opinion. Um, I was, I'm still to this day because I don't get to watch it like that, you guys. I am praying that him and Carly really can work out something. Because I can see them being something. Uh, They're just destroying the character of Johnny. And I don't True. appreciate it. Like, now they got him uh, <clears throat> talking to his dead daddy. This oh, is not shit. One Life to Live. Oh, one Life to Live was oh, canceled for a shit. reason, dude. Oh, okay. Uh, no fucking problem. Props to him, though, for finally getting his balls up. And he killing can, Anthony, but and I'm gonna say he his, his acting is really. But off the, chain, off the chain, dude is a chain. beast. Speaking of acted, uh, last year like I was totally campaigning campaigning for JJ, <laughs> but Jason Thompson, if he don't win that Emmy, okay, then I'm gonna have to like fight somebody. Like it doesn't matter who, I'm just gonna have to fight him because, dude. I don't have to say anymore on that. That guy is fucking awesome. Even before the whole Robin's death scenes. Like when they were on the boat and shit. You know when Lisa had uh, his wife tied up. Like just, ah, I love him. And he deserves it. He truly deserves it. So yeah. Uh, um. Fred says he likes Carly and Johnny. I don't buy it for one second. Like, seriously. Um, 
it's more of her pride than anything and I'm like they were bed buddies for like a couple of months it's like what is that you're no, not in love me, yet you like, haven't no, been in a relationship me, like, no for me we're like <clears throat> That episode when he came to the metro court and he said, I'm like, he brought her, you know what I'm saying, some stuff. And he was like, I'm going to fight for you. you right. And that just had me. You're right there. Pretty she, much. She because Johnny's like, no, awesome bring guy. Out, you bring out the best in me. You're not listening. I didn't have, I mean, Olivia, <coughs> yeah, they was hot together. Man, Joe Olivia was epic, dude. Okay. And like, I, I wasn't there for Lulu and him, so I don't know. Joe Lou was him. epic too. Okay, but it's just like you know, you know, you bitch, you keeping it real. You keep it. I mean, like the niggas say, keep it real. You keep it real. Right. Uh. Okay. So um. Oh y'all, let me tell y'all. That um, Sonny's birthday cake pissed me off when Kate <laughs> fucked that shit up. <laughs> that shit looked that huh? creamy as fuck. <laughs> you know, I would. I, I was pissed at that 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 cake got fucked up. I'm just saying, Everybody I'm a greedy bitch. I'm a greedy bitch, cake. but I'm a greedy bitch, and I was pissed at that cake. Yeah, I see how Michael was smashing the food. Alexis was so worried about that cake. Like, when are they bringing out the cake? Shit, and Michael Carly ate up said, all the Carly food. Said, look, no hungry. sunny, no cake. Okay, I'm out. I'm <laughs> but um, seriously, yes. Uh, Let's see. Um, I can't wait for Matt to leave. I'm so excited about that. Like, I wish Jason Cook, Jason cook all the best but dude bye matt seriously um i think my uh inner lante fangirl is really coming out because like they've been having me lately and lulu like she hasn't been getting on my nerves as much look, like no, oh, oh yeah okay fred says right on um <clears throat> oh i uh i miss my jsap like I'm dying inside slowly. It is it's seriously killing me I bad. Mean, like you. seriously. I mean, I mean. Uh I don't I don't I just I'm not feeling Jason right now. Like I I, no I just uh, just don't understand. I mean I get I get I get it. I, mean, I totally get it. But dude, ugh, stop but being such a little bitch about it. Exactly. Come on now. What's He's up? being I such mean, a little bitch about it. I don't know. Y'all never y'all have been through so I mean I, I have been watching that long, y'all. I can't stress that as much as I can I can only stress uh, that so far. Uh but, but yeah, they how long y'all been they, they <coughs> through some shit, right? Seriously you guys, I mean like let's cut the bullshit and just I don't know, but um, I don't appreciate like if this is true. I waited way too long for this bitch to have a baby. So if they about to do this little yeah, yeah. star and Jessica baby switch thing or whatever, I don't know. They need to just like cut that out right quick. Why is Tay is still pregnant? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, her beach ball thingy is hanging down to her knees. Okay. Yeah. She's been pregnant for like 12 months. That's a year. Almost a year she's been pregnant. Almost a year. There's no reason that she should be pregnant. And they know that. They're just doing that so they can fuck with my Sam some more, bitches. Um, I love, I adore, I adore the Sunny and Todd scenes. Like, I hate them both. I do. But together, they, they just, Fred says right on, together, they just, you know, I don't know. Mm. Oh my god. Um how awesome. I gotta give Kelly Sullivan props because at first I hate it. I am I'm, I'm like I'm I can admit that, you know, I was like, uh, this bitch can't act. But uh like that whole confrontation with her and Sonny, like Connie and Sonny, that shit was fucking beautiful, man. Like especially when she tried to walk away and he's like, wait, 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 wait. A child is dead okay like it was just beautiful i don't know and like when he was watching kate talk to connie <clears throat> and like the tears in his eyes and shit and how he just ran to the other room or whatever to comfort her i think you know that's the guy that i fell in love with and i think he's trying to creep back up on me you know i don't know but uh i thought i was gonna say something else but i totally don't remember oh <laughs> I'm officially done with Tracy because she is such an ignorant bitch. It don't make no sense. Okay. Like, he was like, Venus, what were you planning to do with this rope? 
Okay. And oh, that's what it was. Johnny framing Chasey for his um Anthony's murder. That's not Johnny. Why would they? Why would they do that to him? Why would he do that to Tracy? That's so fucked up. But how they tried to play weekend at Bernie's though, with uh, his body like that. I'm like, what the fuck? Like, I don't know. I'm I'm just glad that they back Luke and Tracy. Another epic pairing right there, because they just. Oh my goodness, Fred says thumbs up. Uh, I really, really hope that they ain't trying to go nowhere with Luke and Anna because I've waited way too long for Luke and Tracy to get back together for Anna to come in town and just, you know, be all like with Luke. I like this. Ain't spending no time with her grandchild. Okay. Is um, Mac and uh, Anna in any relationships? I, I know, say. I wasn't watching back then. That was like a long time ago. They're not related. No, I, they're not relate, are, they're not like related. Like related? Yeah, related. Well, I mean, it's brother-in-law, I guess. If you oh, shit. Then he can have her. The, man, shit. I would fuck that. What I want to know is where is Uncle Mac living since Cameron and Maxie burned down his house like, what, two years ago? Where is he staying at? And now he's jobless? Unless they're going to make him the mayor. Snaps. They had a black mayor. Okay, and a black DA last week. Okay, Braxton from the Jamie Foxx show. I know y'all know. Okay. <laughs> Child, I said they moving up. Uh, oh, um, I think, I think, here. I'm good. I think I have the potential to like Bali and TJ. They're all both cute. Haven't I'll met see how yet. it plays out. Haven't met him. Fred hasn't met him yet because... He's got a job now. Ooh, and he works and doesn't get home till like five. You didn't have to tell. Why you got to tell me? Why you got to? This is the internet. I don't do that. Do I? Do I? Do I? Do I pack it? Do I touch I mean, your shit? Do you know I touch what I mean? Like you like said, keeping it real. That's real. You be sleeping shit. Fuck you. you fuck around. Fuck you. Fuck you. <clears throat> edit that. Edit you know that out. This shit is, I can't. Edit that. Well, we're, we're starting over this now. This shit is unprofessional. I don't care what they This shit is unprofessional. Fuck you. Okay. Fuck you. Um, Lillian. <laughs> okay, we're sorry. We are very sorry. Okay, it, it's fuck it's it's, it's, the, it's her shit. Okay, it's our shit. No, fuck that, man. What is this? Okay, um, I love the fact that Sam is putting her baby first. It makes me, you know, mm. makes me smile. I love the really uh, not the really uh, Fred says right on peace. For his tattoo, it's a peace sign, I guess. Um, I don't know. Get, get. Uh, yeah, no. it's the Is it? Peace. Okay. Uh, I love um, the, uh, call it <clears throat> the little friendship between John and Sam. I just don't like when he touch her because that's not cool. Like, back up, give me 50 feet. Seriously. Um... When um when when Johnny and Ronnie not Johnny but when um Jason and um Jod were talking like after he killed Roddy or whatever uh Jason was like you know you get uh real good at that and um McBain was like what being there and I'm like I just thought that was like such a beautiful line like step your game up fool why can't you be there for your wife but I can. It's not my fault. Don't hate on the swag. Seriously. I love McBain. I don't give a fuck. Pretty hair and all. Um, <clears throat> I don't appreciate how they tried to pin basically every single fucking crime in Port Charles on Ronnie. Like, without any reason, any cause. Why? Like, why did Ronnie go around beating the females? Why did he try to shoot Dante? What was that for? Like, seriously. Also, <clears throat> like, I think since 2009, 2008, I don't, I don't know. I, it was a point. No, 2009. 2009. Like, I don't know. I liked Ronnie because, you know, he was an asshole who kept it real. Like, ever since he said I was planning to pin it on Jason, you know, he was he was honest, you know, and I, I felt that. And then they had to go and turn him into some type of monster. Jamming a fucking gun to my baby's baby. Are you fucking kidding me? Get out of here. So, like, I don't know, man. Um, oh, yes, another thing. It's very important, very crucial. People aren't seeming to, like, realize that Connie is, in fact, the real person and Kate is the author. 
I don't understand why people fail to realize that. Like, why should Kanye have to be trapped inside somewhere just because, you know, no reason at all. Okay, when <clears throat> Jessica had her personality, it was because she was raped, right? And I think the same was for Vicky. So what the fuck is the cause of Connie having a personality, like a separate personality or whatever? What happened to her? Like, what was so bad about, you know, growing up in Bensonhurst with a big-ass family that loves you? that she had to like create another personality they didn't put that in there so it makes no sense to me on why she would have a personality I mean split personality anyway um <clears throat> when Michael bossed up the tie totally got Ladywood I said you better go boy seriously because like I don't remember what he said what Ty said but you know Michael just like stepped up in his face and basically you know in lamest terms I ain't no punk bitch so you know you do what you gotta do and I'm gonna do what I gotta do um <clears throat> uh, I don't know you know um mm. I they um, slow. I know. They um, they pin Maxie down and put face cream all over her and gave her a fucking teardrop. They basically jumped this bitch into a game, <laughs> minus the jumping. I don't know, but the guard was foul. Like seriously, where's the inmates getting money to give to the guard anyway? Seriously, I would like to know that. Um. Since they fired Matt for being the commissioner, I just know they're gonna make him the mayor, right? Cause I just, I just, I just know that. Cause this black lady, we all know she's not gonna be around long because we already have Shine and TJ, so that would just be too many, right? So I see Matt being the mayor. The fact that Maxie was willing to throw Robin under the bus for Matt, she just lost all respect, seriously. Like when they were on the boat playing Clue and shit, she was all, uh, maybe Robin did it, knowing full well she saw Matt kill that woman. And now she's all, uh, oh, now I need to pay because I killed Robin. Oh, let's make everything about me. Let's, oh, make everything about me. Why? Uh, uh, when Matt came over, when Matt came over to fucking ask Patrick for help for Maxie, I wanted to slap the shit out of him. Like, are you serious? This man is still grieving for his wife and you want to, like, come to him for help? For a bitch who like claims she had something to do with her death and like just made a whole spectacle of her funeral like she did Georgie's by the way and just like just just seriously Matt I can't wait for him to go I hope he dies is what I hope it is um uh I really I don't I mean I just really want to know why Liz is always standing around with that empty folder like just waiting for business to jump into and y'all know it's true seriously she does no work she's always at the hospital and she does no work at all she stand around and she just, just wait for business to get into she left Emma at daycare for days I mean she doesn't even spend time with her own kids yeah they had her with um Aiden but she never picked him up or anything so we didn't actually see her with Aiden we know he was in there because Luke picked him up but did she pick him up no why I don't care what anybody says she's calculating manipulative little whore okay <laughs> sorry but that's how I feel I hate her so much right now I don't know she's just nosy she's a nosy little bitch oh my god okay um, <clears throat> it was good to see Patrick back, like I said, back at work and shit, like, 
Pips like, good to see you back, dude. Back in action, huh? What was that? I thought it was uh, what is today? It's Thursday, but day? Uh, so yeah, that was pretty awesome. Uh, dude. <laughs> Can't wait to meet new Christina tomorrow. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, oh, oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How much did I adore Molly? Like, okay, first of all, this is this is another reason why I hate Liz, okay? When Molly was trying to push Jason and Sam, like, you know, together to go to Lamai's class or whatever, how Liz felt like she could butt in and tell Molly that this is for Jason and Sam to decide and like the look Molly gave like why are you here like you have no business being here at all how 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 does she feel like she could do that but she could just stand around and fucking linger and listen to their conversation why isn't she doing any work I mean she's like so worried about Dr. Keenan oh oh you and you and you and why aren't you with you and hmm answer me that and I mean, now since Monica knows about, you know, the whole situation, maybe, you know, he can talk to her. I mean, I I, I can respect the Jizz friendship, whatever, but ugh, it's just too much, seriously. Um, uh, uh, <laughs> I, I, I'm, cause, I'm, cause, I know, but I know, but I'm just, I just don't know. T, 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 she started like the one time in like how many weeks? What, what the fuck is that about, dude? I, mean, I, just, I just don't get it. I just really don't at? get it. How, how many minutes? Ugh. Calm down. 22. Make it 30. 30? Yeah, yeah, make it 30. We can, come on out. 30? Yeah. I'm, I'm gonna talk to him. No. I'm gonna talk to him. Wrap this, uh, shit, wrap this shit up. What you mean, make it 30 then? Okay. You at 22 minutes. Make it um, 30. Make okay. it even 30. A 30 God, minutes. Everything's gotta be yeah. even with you. Okay. Just, just do it. Okay. okay. Just, just do it. Talk shit. Apologize. Um, I kind of like Carly and Todd. Like, not romantically or anything. Like, they just. Oh, death. They see poo. Like poo peeps, I guess. IDK. Uh, I'm, I'm getting a little tired of him being a little bitch about Victor ruining his life. Oh, he stole my life. Oh, blah, 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 blah. Never mind the fact that he was brainwashed and meant, like led to believe that he was fucking tired. It's just, uh, another story and I'm not gonna get into it I'm just sick of Todd Bishon all the time but he is comic relief and I do appreciate that even though I was like not feeling him being on my soap at first because he annoyed me so much on one life to live but I don't know um I love John McVeigh like I know I said that earlier but I just love how he just did everybody's shit like in everybody's shit Jason filed that bug Okay, he said he had Max and Milo sweeping the house for bugs every day. How come they didn't run across that bug? Why are Max and Milo still employed? Oh, and why did Sonny, why did Sonny let that little girl take him hostage? Why did he let Simba come into his house and take him hostage? She does look like Simba, a younger Simba. Like the nose and everything. But whatever. Why? I mean, like seriously though, why would he let her? Why would he let her kidnap him? I I don't get it. But um, uh, All right. shit. You want to talk make the even thirty? And you actually mean? Right. I can't control time. I'm not hero. Okay. Uh. <laughs> 
Uh, Maybe we got nothing else. At all. Yeah, so, so, okay, yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. We're just gonna. Yeah, you know. Just sorry. Gonna let out. <laughs> okay, we're, gonna we're let sorry. Out. Uh, <laughs> bye. Yeah, this has a phone, girl. Okay. Um. Mm-hmm. Did you end it? Hmm? Did you end it? Why did it not stop? Oh. I, I, I hit stop and it 